or we could talk to both of you one after another and you take whichever card looks better. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just go. <laughs> Introduce yourself. Hi, I'm William Yeo, a faculty in the Computer Science and Engineering Department in the McAvoy School of Engineering. I'm a co-director of the Division of Computational and Data Sciences, DCDS. And I'm Patrick Fowler. I'm faculty in the Brown School of Social Work, Public Health, and Social Policy, and I'm also a co-director of the DCDS program. The DCDS program emerged at this unique time in history where our computational insights and power are being leveraged to solve some of the very complex social problems. In most programs, when you come in, you're sort of taught one way to think about data and one way to think about the world and what is good research. And with DCDS, you're constantly being exposed, and not only exposed, but sort of forced to engage with multiple approaches to what makes an interesting question, what makes a good research design, what makes uh, uh, an important output that the world's gonna, that's gonna matter in the world. An example problem that, that we've been tackling is the issue of homelessness. Uh, we have a shifting context of policies, programs, and what people need to stay housed. We also have accumulated lots of information, lots of data, a lot of data streams that help understand the patterns. Work that we've been doing together is thinking about how we can leverage uh, algorithms to change the lives and change the policies. The unique aspect of, of DCDS is that, that we work at these intersections. We have these partnerships where we have faculty in two domain areas and the bridge is the student. And, and oftentimes we are disconnected um, with the actual application. So having a student work at this intersection and have the expertise on both the computational side and the domain side is, is critical so that they know the impact that they can do in the field and also the reasons why the algorithms are important and why the algorithms need to be designed the way they are. This, that, that bridge is a really innovative, collaborative uh, mechanism to bring these, these domains together to solve problems. And oftentimes some um, faculty, they usually work in independent silos. They are comfortable in the environment that they're in. So for example, me in computer science, I'm used to working with computer scientists, but I don't usually get to work with people in social work. But when you put uh, these two groups together, um, re interdisciplinary research made possible because of the students make things happen. So for me, DCDS is, is exciting because the students really work like glue for interested faculty and the students get the opportunity of really seeing the world from multiple perspectives, from multiple fields all at the same time. DCDS started with four tracks. So we have computational methodologies, social work and public health, political science, and psychology. These allow collaborations across our campus in key domain areas. The, the common component is a data-intensive social science. Some students join the program knowing exactly what they want to do. But um, most students do not know that. Um, they come in knowing that they want to work in this intersection to make a difference in the world, but how exactly they have not made up their minds yet. So what the DCDS program provides them are rotation experiences where they work with different groups of professors in different labs, uh, in different settings, and within these rotations, they will hopefully find one that, that calls out to them. Students complete their coursework in uh, the first two years and then dive into a, a dissertation project where they're working intensely with these faculty teams, collaborating around a unique area that combines computational and uh, social aspects. And this works really well because the students actually are going to be co-advised by two different faculty from ideally two different tracks. So for some, for some faculty in computer science, we overlap in our interests, say, in, in some sort of statistical method. But the students come in and help us, right, sort of put that glue together to say we're going to take the sort of common interest in statistics and apply it to some interesting area in political science. But the student comes in with the technical abilities that sort of speaks to me and the ability to sort of speak the sort of language of psychology with, with our, his other advisor and, right, and you can build these really interesting interdisciplinary collaborations that would never have existed without the students being there. Breaking barriers, reaching out, um, and learning about uh, new domains, new languages, in terms of how things are perceived are going to be really important. Yeah, the DCDS program has been wonderful to make connections across campus. Uh, it's an excuse. Our students are our ambassadors to connect us to emerging issues and approaches to all sorts of problems. This has been wonderful when you're trying to make an impact on the world 
because we can't do it alone. If they were, if they were easy, they would be solved already. The program is uniquely situated at WashU by building on the institutional strengths. We have top-ranked medical schools, we have top-ranked Brown School, we have a strong political science department, which is really, really strong in the quantitative side, so in the computation and data side. We have strong AI faculty in the CSE department, and the cool thing is that all of these different people are all within walking distance of each other. We envisioned this program uh, a number of years ago to, to work at these intersections, and it's just surprising how, how well it works. And what really, really amazes me are the students' motivations and drive to learn about new things, um, to tackle challenges um, that, that they have no idea how difficult they are. And as faculty advisors and as directors of the program, when we see them succeed, it's, it's very, very fulfilling.